Today we're gonna talk about some bootleg figures. On the turntable today, we have four knockoffs of some of Hip Hop Toys' greatest grails. And if you're not familiar with those grails, it's because I don't have them, so I've never covered them before, because I usually cover most grails, and I usually have almost all of them. These are bootlegs of some of the grails that I aspire to get one day, but I'm not gonna pay $10,000 or $2,000 for them. I'm gonna try to find them at a better steal if I'm lucky. I'm talking about the OG plastic cell handmade, hand painted Tupac statues and Biggie statues. These things came out in the mid 2000s, probably sometime between 05 to 08. I don't know exactly and I, I'm not prepared to actually give you a correct date because I'm not doing a video on the actual real ones. I'm doing a video on the bootlegs. So I've been seeing these bootlegs floating around eBay and Amazon for a long time. If you came across any of these bootlegs, you'll notice they actually use the same pictures that Plastic Cell used to promote their figures. So the listings are very misleading, but what gives it away is that these things usually sell for about 1,500 to 2,000 bucks. And when you see the bootleg versions, they sell for about 60 to 100 bucks. But I wasn't gonna pay 60 to 100 bucks for bootlegs until a few months ago, these popped up and they were selling for $13.99. So they said, you know what? I could get all of them and then do a comparison video because Plastic Cell actually released a new Machiavelli one or Machiavelli is what they call them. And I could do a comparison video and I can compare the bootlegs to the real ones and show y'all what's the difference and you know if it's worth paying the $300 I believe I paid for the Plastic Cell version or $13.99. Well, these came in the mail today and all four of them came in a bag that was like this big. And I'm like, wait, is this, these came from China. So I'm like, is this, this can't be them. So when I opened the bag, there were four little boxes in there and I'm like, no way. I opened these and I'm like, God damn it. I was kind of pissed off because I expected the bootlegs to at least be the same size. Now, of course I got trigger happy and I didn't read the eBay listing and they did say the size in the eBay listing. So I'm just an idiot for thinking that I could have got something the same size for, you know, a, a fraction of the price that they were advertised. The, the quality on these is kind of, you know, not the greatest, but I mean, I guess I really can't expect much from a bootleg that was $13.99 from China. You have the Pac wearing the white bandana, the red bandana, and the black bandana, which were all actually released at one point in time by Plastic Cell. Different colors had different, different numbers produced. I believe the most rare one might be the white one. And then you have the worst looking one, the Biggie one. This Biggie, barely looks like Biggie. I mean, the skin tone on these, they all kind of look like they're sick. <laughs> the facial sculpt just doesn't look too great. Again, I didn't have high expectations for these. I thought it would be a cool video to make in case anyone was in the market to buy a bootleg one because they couldn't afford the real one because the real ones are going for a lot of money. And even the brand new one, is going for a pretty penny. 300 bucks is not a small ticket, you know, especially if you want to cop one of these. They do have all the detail that the big ones did have, which are the tattoos, which on these, the tattoos are actually etched into the skin, which is a little weird now that I think about it. And they have like a gloss finish to all of these. I mean, I think what I may end up doing with these is attaching some sort of string to them and making them like Christmas ornaments because they're just really small and not as big as I expected them to. Again, for $13.99, can't really complain. And if you're in the market for some of these, they're all over the internet, all over eBay, and they start at around $13.99 being the cheapest and they go all the way up to like 25, 30 bucks. Pac ones have them in bandanas. They have the tats. He has his Jesus piece on, his boxer showing. And then the Biggie one has the classic Biggie with the Kooji sweater. Um, some funky ass kicks that look like, I don't even know what the hell these are. They don't look like Tim's. They look like a hybrid between like a Tim, a lug and a sneaker. Uh, it also has him rocking a gold chain, which is not a Jesus piece. It's just, you know, a piece of gold around his neck. All in all, 
It's $13.99. Can't expect much. Thanks for watching. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe. Follow me on Instagram if I missed anything. If you have anything to add to the conversation or simply want to be like, yo, these things are trash, leave it in the comments. I'd love to hear from you. Peace. Thank you.